In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use an AI SEO tool, which is perfect for local businesses looking to rank their website on the first page of Google. It's also fantastic for agencies that need to scale and manage multiple SEO campaigns efficiently. I'll show you how to use this AI tool to boost your Google business profile and keep track of its progress, but I'll also walk you through how to create a complete content strategy for your website, and then use the tool's AI copywriting feature to write value-driven articles and blogs. And finally, I'm gonna show you how to use this tool to optimize your content so it can rank on the first page of Google. So stick around until the end because you do not want to miss this. All right, so we've been using Search Atlas a lot in our agency recently, and it's really impressive. So the first thing we're going to dive into is the heat map feature. Now there are some similar tools out there, but we found this one to be the most accurate and reliable we've ever used. And this is how it works. So first you enter your domain and link your Google business profile. Then you want to add specific keywords that you want your websites and Google business profile to show up for. So for instance, this is our client who is a garden room installer in Essex. So we're looking at keywords like garden rooms, garden rooms Essex, garden room installer in Essex, and garden room installer. Now these are all the potential keywords a person might search on Google when they're looking for a garden room installer in Essex. So now this tool will tell us in which position our Google business profile is ranking on the map pack in the Essex area whenever someone types in these exact terms into Google. Now this is really important to know because your Google business profile is one of the most crucial elements for generating leads. So you wanna make sure it's set up correctly. Once it's all set up and optimized, it can be tricky to determine if your profile is ranking in the top three across multiple areas. But that's where Search Atlas comes in handy. It provides a heat map that shows you exactly where your profile is ranking. Now this is how you set the heat map up. You can add keywords by entering them from here. Next, you need to select how many layers you want. The layers indicate how dense you want the data points to show up. Typically, three layers is a good balance. After that, you want to set up the radius of the scan. Let's set it to a five mile radius around the business. We also have the option to refresh this data monthly or even daily. Although personally, I think daily might be a bit excessive. So in most cases, refreshing it monthly works just fine. Now, once that's set up, we run a local scan. You'll see the tool generates a heat map showing a five mile radius around where the business is located. It then displays pins on the map indicating where the business is ranking for the selected keywords and right away you can see we're ranking in the top three of the map pack for many of these areas so this is a solid indication that the map listing is performing really well you can easily switch between different keywords and see the rankings from each over here now if we zoom out a bit we can see a broader view of where the business ranks for example when we look at the term garden rooms it's ranking number one across various locations and without a tool like this you wouldn't know exactly where your business is ranking let's say we want to refine the heat map or adjust the the radius to four miles. You can do it easily from here. As you can see, after changing the radius, we're still ranking in the top three across the board for all of these keywords. You can adjust this as much as you like and track multiple listings at once. It's an excellent way to monitor where your Google business profile is ranking. And if you notice a drop in any area, it usually means you need to optimize your profiles further by adding more photos, getting more reviews, or by posting more frequently. And we've got an entire step-by-step -step guide on how you can set up and optimize your Google business listing. And I'll share the link to that video in our description. Now, you can also set up weekly reports to be sent directly to your email, giving you updates if there are any changes in the ranking. This is just a great way to stay on top of your local SEO and ensure your business maintains strong visibility in your key areas. So next, we're gonna use Search Atlas to give us a solid content plan. First, you go into the content planner section and from here, we can create a strategic content plan tailored to your website's requirements. So for instance, let's say we're working on a loft conversion website. We will enter in a broad keyword like loft conversions and then adjust our location settings to the UK. After that, we'll click on generate keyword clusters. Now this is really useful because it helps us identify topic ideas that are relevant and valuable for our content strategy, whether we're focusing on service pages or blog posts. Now by entering a broad keyword, the tool provides a detailed content plan, complete with suggestions for various content types and AI powered copywriting tools to help generate the actual content. And once it's ready, we click to view the topics. Here we see a range of keyword clusters and topic ideas. As you can see, there is this keyword, attic storage, along with its keyword difficulty and search volume. And we can use these metrics and select topics that have a reasonable chance of ranking well on Google. As we scroll down, you can see this keyword, loft conversion drawings. 
Now this keyword has a high search volume and a low keyword difficulty, making it an excellent choice for us to create a blog on. If we then go to Google and search for loft conversion drawings, we see numerous search results, including pages specifically dedicated to this topic, such as loft conversion plans or architectural drawings. Seeing that there's already demand and content around this topic on other websites shows us that it's a relevant and potentially great topic to target. Now once you've identified a topic using the content planner tool, the next step is to create the actual content. Now this tool makes that process very easy and very efficient. You start by clicking on create article where you can input your primary keywords such as loft conversion drawings or loft conversion drawing cost. The tool will also suggest additional keyword ideas that can help optimize your content further. You can then proceed by clicking on write with AI. Now to structure the article you need to add all the header tags like the h1, the h2 and the h3. You also need to put in terms to include or terms to exclude and depending on your preference you can choose from various AI models like ChatGPT or Claude to help in the writing. Now here's a pro tip. To fill in all the H2 and H3 header tags, check out existing top ranking articles on Google on similar topics. Then use their headings and subheadings. For instance, if a competitor's H2 heading is plan your loft conversion, you can change that heading a bit and put in something like how to plan your loft conversion. This allows you to create content that is both original and relevant. Now you can add AI generated images, create FAQ sections to address common questions, and even decide on the length of the content. Then just add a brief description of what you want to be included in the blog over here. Once you're satisfied with all the details that you've added, simply click on Generate AI Content. Now Search Atlas will start creating the entire article based on the inputs we've just provided. And voila, within minutes you now have a fully written article. What we recommend doing is using this tool to create AI generated articles for multiple different keywords. It's a great way to build up a variety of content around different topics that are relevant to your audience. And if your website is on WordPress, you can plug the tool directly into your site and push the article right onto it. However, I wouldn't suggest just copying and pasting the AI generated content straight onto your site without a human review first. While AI generated content can provide a solid baseline, it's not quite at the level where you can just publish it as it is. What you really want to do is have a human editor go over the content first. The AI might get you 80% of the way, but that last 20%, the nuance, the tone, the quality of the information still needs a human touch. Make sure you're always going over the content carefully to ensure it offers way more value than what's currently out there. It should have a good structure, offer solid advice, and provide more in-depth information than other articles on the same topic. Essentially, it should be the best article on the subject on the internet. And if it's not meeting that standard, it's just not worth posting. Now let's create another AI generated article based on these keyword ideas. So for example, we can see that types of loft conversions is getting around a thousand searches per month and the difficulty level is very easy. You can simply click on create article, select the keywords you want the article to rank for and Search Atlas will even give you an estimate of how much traffic you can expect from this article. Now let's just fill in all the details. So let's put in types of loft conversions as the H1. Then for your H2s you can add different types of loft conversions. So Vlux or roof light, Dorma, hip to gable, mansard and modular. Then select the AI model, so let's select Claude this time. After that we can choose the tone of the article, casual, professional, funny, angry if you really want. And over here we will write a short description about what should be included in the article and then click on create article. And there you go, Search Atlas starts writing the entire article for you. It will cover all the different types of loft conversions, diving into details about each one. After the article is generated, it also gives you a score out of 100. So at the moment, this article content score is 65. And what you want to do is go through and make adjustments. The tool also provides suggestions like how many times you should mention a keyword and it shows which websites are ranking on top for these keywords. This gives you an idea of what competitors are doing and what you need to do to improve your own content. It's a fantastic tool for building content, but remember to always look over the AI generated content with a human eye. Sometimes the AI might miss the mark, so you'll need to use your professional expertise to fine tune the article. Thank you for watching until the end. I hope you got a lot out of the video. So our goal here is to help you generate the best quality leads so you can fill out your diary with more customers and grow your business. And that's it from me. And by the way, if lead generation is a problem for you right now, then there's a link in the description that's gonna help you solve that problem in under three minutes. And if you want more tips on running an agency and getting more leads, there's another link in the description where we've built a series of videos just for you. I wanna say a big thank you again for watching this video. If you wanna see more like this, please like and subscribe, and also leave a comment in our comment section. We read and respond to all the comments we get. Have a great day, I'll see you on the next one.